Welcome back, everybody. We've all wondered what professional hockey players do on their days off besides play golf. Well, our next guest writes children's books. Lee's forward, Zach Hyman, joins us this morning to talk about his latest book and how he brought his grandfather's stories to life in The Magician's Secret, your third book. Congratulations. Thank you so much. So just before we get on to that, <laughs> how about them nights? I know, it's crazy. Is that, like, where did this team come from? Like, honestly, they, yeah. they were supposed to be okay for the first couple of years. Right? I know, then it just shows you, uh, you put a couple of good players together and then you have a great team and if everything goes right for you, like it's going right for them, I mean, it's pretty special the run they're on. And you're pretty special. As I mentioned yeah. earlier, you're 25, pro NHL star for the Leafs. This is your third book and you're newly engaged. Good on you and you're only 25 years in. <laughs> I mean, what's left? How, I asked if you're a creative writer in school and you said yes and it shows because you clearly love to do this as a passion. Yeah, I do. It's uh, I'm the oldest of five boys, so I got four younger brothers, and storytelling was always a big part of my life. And making sure my younger brothers were, were happy before they go to bed, so <laughs> helping my parents out, and uh, I loved writing. So uh, the two kind of just came together, and uh, now I have three children's books. So tell me about the Magician's Secret. Yeah, the Magician's Secret kind of veers off the path I've been on. I've, my pe first two books were about sports, and this third one's about imagination and magic. And um, it's a connection I have with, with my grandfather. He always told stories, so I've been using kind of the stories he told me and uh, just making my own up. So let's talk about that because you said one was about your maternal grandfather and this one's about your paternal grandfather. Mm -hmm. So what story did you want to share in his likeness? Yeah, uh, my, my paternal grandfather, so my dad's dad, uh, would always tell me and my brothers these stories about how he was uh, a baseball player and the next day he was an NFL player and we go around to school and tell tell our friends these stories and they'd be like, no way, and we'd fully believe them. And uh, so I put in a bunch of those stories in there and then my maternal uh, grandfather actually was a Holocaust survivor, so he would tell me some very real stories. Um, so I kind of have those real stories and then those uh, really fun stories, and uh, they, they both come to make uh, the big story that I made up. Uh, you have uh, the great Joe Bloom. Uh, is the illustrator for this book, mm -hmm. Emmy award-winning, Academy mm -hmm. award-winning. Uh, how did you get connected with him and tell, tell me what he thought of this project? Yes, he was an, Joe Bloom's an Academy award-winning illustrator and I'm really lucky to have him on board and uh, we sent him the story and it was kind of a, a shot in the dark and he, he read it and he had that same connection that I have with my grandfather. He has that similar connection and he just fell in love with the story. So he actually, the, the grandfather in the story is is drawn to his grandfather's likeness. So it's pretty cool and uh, we, we sat down for dinner one day and we got along really well and um, so just really happy to have him. I imagine your family is so proud of you for a multitude of reasons. To see this sex successful career thrive as an author, can we expect many more? Is this something you really love to do and will continue to churn out? Yeah, it is. I mean, I love writing children's books. It, being able to interact with, with kids is awesome. I was actually at a school visit the other day at Colson uh, Public School in Milton and, and uh, we talked about books and, and, and play and uh, it's, it's just awesome and I have one more uh, one more kids book plan right now. So I think it's going to be a basketball book. So oh yeah, book oh, right back to yeah. a hockey book. Yeah, back to no. I already have a hockey book. Okay. I got to keep it keep it in line. So moving, yeah. do you play basketball too? No, <laughs> not anymore. <laughs> I mean, I watch basketball. So I, let's I go Raptors. It. Yeah. Or are you a yeah, LeBron but, fan? No, I'm a Raptors oh. fan. But I mean, LeBron's <laughs> doing pretty well. <laughs> <laughs> I know, but still, you have to root for the Raptors. I have to be nosy. Yeah. You're getting asked, I'm sure, when is the date? It's so <laughs> exciting to see a young couple in love. You recently got engaged. Age. Yeah, yeah. Soon, so. summer wedding? Oh, you have Alana there. Yeah, yeah summer wedding. Beautiful. So I'm sure she's watching. So big, big hello to Alana. I think we're gonna we're getting in married next the end of next June. So after hopefully after a long playoff run. We'll yes, exactly. Yeah. yeah. Enjoy the engagement. That's the best part. Is all the yeah, be great to have this, It'd be great to have the Stanley Cup at the reception. Yeah. <laughs> just saying. Drink champagne out of the cup. Yeah. So uh, talk to us about that just a little bit more. I'm curious. Sure. Are you going to be hands on? Are you going to help pick up the flowers, the DJ, the cake? Oh man, the planning's already started. So she's the boss on that. Yeah. Just do yourself a favor. <laughs> step step back and, uh, and no. nod. Oh, trust me. <laughs> yeah, I know. Yeah. I know. I've already uh, we're still over a year out still, but I'm I'm getting all the all the feedback from her, and she's got. Right now it's the off season, so I. I have to go to all these meetings. <laughs> I don't have much excuse, but it's it's fun and uh, planning's planning's good. But that's her thing, and I'm just uh, I'm happy to be helping. All right, go out to the Indigo Burlington Mall this Saturday afternoon, two o'clock. You're going to be signing some books. Go pick up your copy and uh, say hi to Zach. Thank you. Awesome. Will you sign Thank this for you. my nephew? Of He's course. a huge fan. We'll of do course. that during the break. Right now, over to Mel. Thank you.